This reading is for Sagittarius. It's intended for Sagittarius Sun, though it may also resonate with Sagittarius Moon and Sagittarius Rising as well. So uh, this reading starts with the card of grounding. And for you, this also has to do with perceptions or it has to do with a legal matter. Trying to find balance, holding on too tightly to control control of a partner or a close one-on-one -on -one relationship, maybe because you have self-worth issues or money issues. You controlled a new beginning or someone around you controlled a new beginning by holding on too tightly. There needs to be, if there was not already, forgiveness around this situation involving your home, your roots, your stability, your family, um, any of that kind of stuff, okay? You may have self-worth issues regarding a child, a romance, or a creative project. Doesn't have to be, but that's kind of the feeling. So basically you're holding on too tightly to control of a new beginning and there needs to be some sort of forgiveness here around um, a family matter. There could be something about a child's transition or a romance transition or a creative project transition could be involved for some of you. This is very interesting though, because it's like saying I forgive my family but then moving really, really slow and intentional around the situation. I'm seeing some sort of an agreement that had been made that you knew about. Maybe others didn't. And that's why you were able to take your time. And with the sacred space being in the middle, this could be like your home or um, your work or, you know, it's something that matters to you, something that feels like home to you, right? It's something like that. There's some sort of an agreement that was made sexually that you had intuition about or knew about or an agreement about a child that you knew about or about a creative project that you knew about and kind of drawing this out but I'm just trying to make sure I give you all the details that I can see you knew about something here and so it's saying for legal reasons, you are emotional about letting go of control. You may be emotional about letting go of control of a close one-on-one -on -one relationship um, because it brought you some sort of stability. Or this could have something to do with a close one-on-one -on -one relationship with a family member could even be that for some of you, but I'm seeing you're emotional about letting something go. So it's kind of got this huffy puffy feel to it. I don't know how to explain that. This huffy puffy, I'm going to stand my ground kind of energy to it, right? Because you knew of an back, let's say a, a behind the scenes deal. That's, that's the way I'm going to put it. You were aware of some sort of behind the scenes deal that went on and because of that you benefited that's what I'm seeing you benefited in some way but I'm also seeing something for some of you it may be something about a family work situation or family reputation. There might be something going on as far as that's concerned as well that you took your time with. 
but it says you kind of stepped away because you, in some sense, the word profited from some sort of change here. Because you were angry. I don't know what that means. It says something there, something about a change in being angry. You were angry and slow as it related to something that was, you know, a sacred space for you. Something about celebrating a transition here or um, reuniting and changing something. Okay, I'm going to tell you what I get here. I get that you profited from something in some way. There was, um, and you pretended not to be angry and reunited to transform the situation so there would be an illusion that you were receptive to rising above a situation, but you transformed it or ended it, whatever that means. Yeah. I still get that you're having a hard time moving on, whatever that means. So ground your energy, forgive, allow the emotions to come out. The possibilities are still there, but you're gonna have to change your aggression or your anger issues if you want to see this move into something steady or um, fruitful in any sense of the word. I think you're trying to protect yourself or trying to protect the sacred space, whatever that means. But, but I also see where it's something that you agreed to or someone else agreed to, but now you're angry about it. I don't, I don't get what that means, but that's what's showing up, all right? So please make sure to like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you all again soon. Bye, guys.